YouTube, what's going on with y'all Ken folk? It's your friendly neighborhood sneaker man, Goat Weezy. Weezy F baby, please say the baby. Back on the scene with a pocket full of green, and you know we go back like two flats on the Cadillac. Back at y'all again, man, with another early review. Now, if you are new over here, make sure you hoax smash that subscribe button for your boy. Ring that notification bell so you don't miss out on anything that I put out. And make sure you like this thing and share this thing so it can help the channel grow. And bro, it don't cost y'all nothing but free. 99 free for y'all free for all man so y'all make sure y'all do that now i hope everybody is having a happy new year but man the ball keep rolling man 2020 was a dud especially for me but these jordans and these sneakers gonna keep running now if y'all hear some noise and i look over there i got a new dog my dog sitting there over there in the cage she probably gotta go to the bathroom but i gotta oh, hold on let me take it to the bathroom right quick Alright y'all, yeah, so my baby had to go to the bathroom. But nah, man. Y'all see the title, y'all probably see the thumbnail. Early look at the Jordan 1 Vote Gold. Bro, I, I can't wait to show y'all these. Shout out to my boy Black Diamond Kicks, aka Chris, my boy Chris. He blessed your boy with another early pair to review. So without further ado, let's go ahead and do this thing. Alright, now, New Year, nothing changed. You got your regular black Jordan 1 box, regular black and red Jordan 1 box, and you got the label, let's see, the label reads Air Jordan 1 Retro High OG, white black Volt. This is a size 10 and a half, and these are retailing for $170. Let y'all see that. And these come out on January 9th. The original release date was January 2nd, but they changed the release date to the 9th. <laughs> Let y'all see that. Get some focus for y'all, man. Now, this is the first Jordan Retro 1 of the year. And I'm going to let y'all know. Y'all need to put in y'all footwork because y'all know Jordan 1s always sell out. Um, they ain't easy to get. You're not going to be able to just walk in the store and get. Y'all should know that by now anyway, man. All right. So, opening the lid, we have our red stamp on that thing. Let's, I don't know if y'all can see that, but we got our red stamp. And showing this to y'all. Like I said, this is a size 10, so I won't be doing it on foot because I can't wear 10 and a half, 10, whatever this is. 10 and a half, I'm sorry. Y'all know I wear a size 12. But here we have it. Boom. We have the Retro Jordan 1 Volt Gold. And just looking at these, man, I know I looked at early pictures of these. These were not on my radar, but I saw a picture of Jada Sneaker Guy. You know, Jada Sneaker Guy. He does the lace swap. They call him Mr. Swap It Out. Bro, he put some gold, not gold, he put some Volt laces in them things, bro. And them Volt laces made it pop. So it kind of changed my mind on these. I was on the fence, but I think I'm going to go ahead and get these, especially if I can find some Volt shoe laces to go with them. I'm definitely going to cop these. These weren't on my radar at first. But going into quick details of the sneaker, all right, we have an all black outsole all black outsole and these kind of giving me biohack vibes for some reason it reminds me of like a alternate or a, in a way you know you got your home in a way in an alternate these kind of remind me of an alternate or in a way version colorway of the biohacks you know all right now heading up onto the midsole we have a sale midsole now i thought jordan brand was done with the sale but they bringing the eggshell colorway back on the midsole. All right, now heading up into the toe cap. Man, we got some plush leather around that toe cap, man, where the black toe is. You know, I'm, I'm loving the black toe vibes, man. That, that leather is plush as a mug. And heading into the toe cap, we got some plush toe cap on that thing, man. All right, now we have a white mid-base upper. Uh, the, the leather ain't really tumble, you know, it ain't really shattered backboard quality. You know, we gotta always say shattered backboard quality when we talking about the ones, man. But it ain't really tumble leather, it's, it's all right, man. All right, now heading into the back heel, you have your gold on that back heel of that thing. And I, I like the feel of that, man. I, I definitely like the feel of that. Heading on up where our Jordan Wings logo is, we have that Volt Green and it pulls back that vote green that pulls back on that thing all right 
and we have a mesh tongue now the tongue has the same details as the biohack now with the toe with the tongue tag the tongue tag is flipped so where the nike air is supposed to be the nike air is actually on the inside of the tongue this time man which is crazy all right now they do come factory lace with a set of sail laces with the factory laces and they come with an extra set of black laces so y'all know what it is when people are talking about reviewing early sneakers my boy is legit my boy is featured out in memphis where a lot of the shoes on the east coast come from so i put his i ain't mean to put his i ain't putting it all his business out there but y'all get the vibes man but we got uh alternate pair or extra set of pair of black laces like i said earlier i saw a picture that jay the sneaker guy had posted and he put the vote laces in them things and like i said i wasn't gonna get these before but if I can find a set of Volt laces, I'll definitely end up getting these. Um, I feel like I can just beat these up, man. Like, I don't like it, but I'll be able to get mine for a discount. I'm not sure what the resale numbers are going to do, but it is a Jordan 1. And we all know Jordan 1s always sell out. Like, no Jordan 1 is safe. So, I'm definitely going to cop my pair. Uh, maybe an extra pair to hold for resale. And a grade school pair, because you know the grade school pairs, they always sell, man. But yeah, man, y'all let me know in the comment section below how y'all feel about these. Once again, the Air Jordan 1 Volt Gold. These are releasing on January 9th, retailing at 170 rump shakers. So y'all let me know how y'all feel about these. Like I said, I was kind of on the fence, but I think Jay the Sneaker Guy <laughs> made me change my mind up, man. But anyway, it's been your friendly neighborhood sneaker man, Goat Wheezy, once again. Thank y'all for coming through as usual. Hey, man, we got an early review of the Jordan 1's Boat Gold. Hey, y'all know how I get out of here, baby. Love, peace. And when all this beef, put some chicken grease on that thing. Out of here.